Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to upgrade the bearings on your Daiwa Steez reel. Now, first of all, you're going to need the reel. You're going to need a small screwdriver. A coin. Some electrical tape. A fishing hook. And a spool pin removal tool. This is the one that I use. It's from Hedgehog Studios. Um, a lot of Japanese tackle websites or eBay, they sell this tool. It's very great for removing the spool pin without scratching the spool. And of course, you're going to need a uh, real lube. Now, this is the one I use. It's the Lightning Lube High Speed Oil from Boca Bearings. It's specially formulated for ceramic and stainless steel bearings. It works really, really good. This is the set of bearings that you're going to need from Boca. This is the model number right here. You can uh, find it under a model search and select the Steez Baycast reel. This is going to give you the option. So just look at this number and you'll get it. The first thing that we're going to do is to remove the side plate from the reel. You see this big screw here? We're going to take the coin and then screw it. After that, just spin the side plate and remove it. You can remove the spool easily. I would suggest using electrical tape to tape the line if you have line on the spool. And you can put the rest of the reel away. Now before we install the bearings in the reel, we're going to prep the bearings. So what I mean by that is we're going to remove the seals and put some oil in it. Now to remove the seals, take the fishing hook put it at the inside of the seal and the seal pops right off. Now for those of you who fishes in rivers or places who have a lot of sediments, you only have to remove one side of the seal because uh, you're going to have to put the seal back on. For me, because I fish from a boat, that doesn't really concern me and I like to run my bearings without the seals. This allows me to, uh, to put oil in it a lot easier and it's easier to clean as well. The next thing we're going to do is to put some oil in the bearings. Just put a drop in each bearing. And there, that's done. The first bearing we're going to be replacing is the one on the side plate. As you can see, there's a retainer holding the bearing in place. What you want to do is take a finger and hold the retainer and remove it with a small screwdriver. The finger will prevent the retainer from flying away. And all you have to do is to take the retainer off, use a screwdriver, remove the bearing, and put the new one in place. Take the retainer and pop it back in. And there, one down. The next bearing we're going to be replacing is the one on the spool. As you can see, there's a spool pin right here holding the bearing in place. The first thing we want to do is to put a piece of electrical tape on the spool lip. This is going to prevent the tool from scratching the lip. There's two ends to the spool, to our spool pin removal tool. There's the pointy end, and there's the blunt end. The pointy end right here is for spool pin removal. The blunt end is for installation. I'm going to put the spool pin removal tool over, and start turning. Just take the spool pin off, remove the bearing, and put the new one in, just like that. 
we're going to switch sides and put the blunt end in put the pin back and use the tool to reinstall the pin just turn until there's equals um, equal lengths of the pin sticking out on each side of the spool shaft and there you just uh, change the bearing on the spool the last step is going to be reinstalling everything uh, we're going to take the spool with the bearings facing the inside of the reel and push it back in and reinstall the side plate Turn the screw on the side and use the coin to tighten it. Now there are several benefits in upgrading the bearings on the Steez. Um, the Steez is actually a pretty fussy caster and part of the reason is, is that um, the bearings is not really consistent enough. By changing the bearings, it allows the spool to start up easier and gives you a more consistent cast, which means less backlash. The better bearings is going to spin longer and give you a longer distance cast as well. Now to order your bearings, you can go to www.bocabearings.com. Thanks for watching the video and I hope it helped you. Thank you very much.